Good morning everyone and welcome back to day two of our seven day cruise. Today we are in Ketchikan, Alaska and I really look forward to exploring this beautiful historic city and enjoying the wonderful sights. We've got a nice sunny day ahead of us so let's go see what Ketchikan has to offer. Good morning from Ketchikan, Alaska. We are outside the Pioneer Cafe where we are about to go inside and try reindeer. Let's go. I'm super excited about this. I think we made a, made a mistake how much food we ordered. I think we may have an alarming amount of food. We'll be in a food coma by noon. What's the last Oh wow. Those are huge pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> Eggs and reindeer sausage. Amazing. Now reindeer meat is extremely common up in Alaska, but since we've never had it before, we couldn't miss the opportunity to try it for the first time. I can only describe it as a kielbasa texture with a gamier taste. It was really, really good. So after we've just left the Pioneer Cafe, we decided to take a walk around the block real quick and we have come across what is famously known here as the Salmon Ladder. It's really interesting. So as you probably know, salmon swim upstream to spawn and if there's a big falls here that they have trouble getting up, so they've built a ladder that the salmon can use to go up. So let's take a look at it. So they swim in here and then they can go up and around and up. And making our way to Creek Street, this was Ketchikan's red light district from 1903 to 1954 and in 2014 was placed on the National Registry of Historic Places. As you can tell there are three cruise ships here right now and it's, it's getting a little busy. <laughs> so I'm staying in front of the famous Dolly's house saloon. Uh, was a brothel a long time ago. If you've ever seen the last video, you, you know exactly what this place is. Interesting fact about Dolly's house during Prohibition, they had a trap door on the floor under the bar so that if they were raided, they could drop the bootleg whiskey into the creek. If you're looking for Dolly's house, by the way, so that's Dolly's house, and then there's the cruise ship. All of this Creek Street stuff is within 100 feet of the cruise port super easy to get to. So I'm standing here in front of one of the many totem poles that you'll find scattered throughout Ketchikan. There's actually a totem pole heritage museum and a couple of different places you can go. They all seem very busy with people. So I found this one in the middle of the parking lot. Let's go take a look at it. Very 
wanted to share a few interesting facts about Ketchikan. I've got some notes here, so I'll make sure not to forget anything. Um, Ketchikan has many names. It's known as Alaska's first city. It was founded in 1885 as a salmon cannery site, which earned it another nickname as the Ketchikan Salmon Capital of the World. Uh, Ketchikan is only accessible by sea or by air. It is 31 miles long, but only 10 blocks wide. Ketchikan is famous for their totem poles. There are some that were built as replicas, but there are a lot of original native totem poles that have been restored. Uh, there's even a museum and a park where you can go to visit several totem poles. Uh, Creek Street is the famed red light district, uh, which existed until 19. Uh, we just wanted to say thank you to everyone who supports us, whether that is uh, liking our videos, watching, subscribing, um, the people who know us in real life and, and support us. We, we really appreciate it. We don't say it enough, but it means a lot to us that, that you all watch the videos and that you are so supportive. And thanks to Nick. Thank, thank you, Nick and Audrey, for these coffees. We really appreciate we it. We really do buy thank coffee with the money. Love you. And if you also like to help support us, you can go to buymeacoffee.com slash simplified travels. There's a link in the description below. And I think we're going to go ahead and get back up on the ship and relax a little bit. And we'll see what else tonight brings. Bye.